Are you mad? Are you mad? Are you mad? It's not real. So mad. <laughs> the tambourine and the shakers in there i just want the acoustic uh you can leave them in okay do, cool. do, do they come in on the chorus um i have them kind of broken down and like very subtle and uh it That's gets more fun. intense all right cool i'll play it like that here we go oh okay start over okay because i thought that was going to say one two three four Oh, I can uh, put your one, two, three, four in there if you want. No, nah, that's fine. All right, cool. Tell me how in our hearts we found home. Well done. Do we need to, we need to fix anything? Uh, yeah, if we could do it one more just because there was a few parts that I didn't get the level correctly, and you might be a little too loud. But everything um, sounds like the first, I would say 70% of the song was spot on, and then maybe uh, it could be a little bit better towards the end. So if you want to do, do you have it in you for one more? Yeah, that's it. Cool. Let's take it from the top. That was great. I think if we do one more just for, for good measure, uh, and I'll start you a little further back, then we can wrap it. It's interesting because it's really sentimental and makes me think of more than just chickens. It's like an objectively good song. That was like absolutely perfect up until the last chorus. I think if you do the last chorus, then uh, we'll be good. It's like the change gets me. Right. Now, if you want to try that lower octave thing, we can totally do that as well. That's so easy to do. Yeah. All right, here, let me set up a new track here. Drag this down here. And I will start you from the very beginning. Well, just play my vocal, can you play my vocals along with it, or? Oh, yeah, okay. yeah. Uh, I will do that right now. Time that it took for you to come around. So tell me how in our hearts we found home. Chicken City theme song. Chicken City theme song. Roberto is a big rooster, the sheriff of Chicken City. And his son, Roberto Jr., is his deputy. Together they protect the hands as they have a chicken party. It's just another peaceful day as we hang out in Chicken City. Whoa, in our hearts we found home. Good. Is that all we, we needed? All right. <laughs> Nailed it.
push it in hard. Oh. Is that doing anything? Uh, well, just stop, stop. Uh, Probably need a different need a new one. Let me see this. You want to grab some screws real quick? We'll fix this thing up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or I can maybe cheat it. This is what happened. It's totally broken. Is there one in there? Yeah. Oh. I feel like it's got a higher power on it than that. If you uh, twist it. There we go. I ruined that. Here you go. Hard to do with one hand. Yeah. Like if you fall, you fall. Alright. Yeah, I don't know. <laughs> I, I don't think I even Well, you probably start that right over. Maybe I have fallen or tried to, but I, I think it, I, I swear I thought. This is my meteorite dragon knife. Forged for a meteorite. Wow. Gotta oil it. Every day or every week? Once a week. Just put a little bit of choji oil on it. Carries around a dagger from World War II that my grandfather had. Oh wow! It's all rusty though. Oh. He's convinced someone's gonna sneak in the house at night. He's gonna be ready. That's why you gotta oil it. So it doesn't rust. Good for him. He's prepared. He's definitely prepared. So if I said you're more likely to stab me than the <laughs> intruder, I'm afraid. Yeah. <laughs>